So this is the main web browser. Uh, the default IP address is 192.168.1.1. You can also change the IP address uh, from the dials in front, and that'll change just the last octet. So when they're all up, it's going to be your default settings, uh, but you can change it. You can see a 100, a 10, and a 1. Uh, and then to change the IP address, if you if you click on system, you can set your IP address right here. The default password is always private. It's, so it's private, all lowercase. And then you can set your IP address and subnet to whatever you need. After we put in the subnet mask and the IP address, we hit submit. It's going to ask you for the username and admin and password is private, all lowercase. Now we can change the IP address in our web browser to 192.168.131. As you can see, we switched it to 131 now. Um, and now if I click on ports, this, this is some just additional diagnostics. If you had any devices plugged in, they would show up here. It would show what was plugged in. Uh, it would show, you know, just some additional information. As you can see, if any, your all your process data is going to show up, whether your a port is on or not, in this case, we have a Balif hub plugged in. Uh, 